I'm a scientist, so I may be biased, but because I know everything that goes into the formulation, because I know what's behind and how much testing and effort we at the Joint Research Center and the industries and the official controls are putting into the safety of packaging, as a consumer, I have to say I'm very happy. You need to have products that have a certain flexibility. In order to have this flexibility, you need to have additives, which are plasticizers. This plasticizer, it's a little bit like fabric softeners. It makes the plastic more stretchy and elastic. That happens for this joint, for the, the gaskets of these jars. It can be also in other types of packaging. For example, I want an easy open need as a consumer. Well, you need to make it flexible. So you have these substances. These substances will have the tendency to like and be liked by fatty foods, so oils. So when we have fatty products with some additives like plasticizers, then we need to have an eye on those. They're chemicals. They, there is a limit to which that they're perfectly fine even if they're ingested because there is nothing in nature that doesn't have chemicals. It's a myth. So there is a safe limit, but if it's not compliant with the law, these products have to be removed from the market. It doesn't mean that they're unsafe, but the rules in place, they have to be respected. Mm -hmm. 